It's perfect. Yep. Like, the, I could tell the red teams, like, the red team, they kept it close for, like, the first game, but they started to panic a little bit mm -hmm. once. Uh, I, I feel like DZ and Son are just way more disciplined yep. doubles players. Their positioning was, like, immaculate. As you said, like, uh, Son was positioned on the platform perfectly during the edge guard situation. Mm -hmm. Even on stage two, they weren't too clustered up. They weren't bunched up at any point. They were either, they were always sa sandwiching or cornering their opponents at any instance. And if they were cornering their opponents, they were not, like, they weren't together. Yep. And another thing, like, about doubles as well, especially that we saw uh, Son and DZ do so well, it's not about, like, wanting to get certain follow-ups from, like, your opponent's combo moves, but rather just always constantly positioning yourself so that the combos can, or the follow-ups can just drop into your lap really, really right, naturally. exactly. It's, positioning is so key in doubles. Like, you could have, you could have like, butterfingers and have the worst button-pressing yep. tech skill ever. But if you can just squeak out the correct yep. aerial at the correct time and be in the correct place at the correct time, you're going to get that mm -hmm. kill. Yep. Like, du doubles is a whole different game from singles in that your, your decision-making tree becomes a lot more simplified, but your decisions that you have to make become more diverse yep. because there's more potential for chaos. There's more mm -hmm. potential for any, any, anything you could put on paper mm -hmm. will work. Your, doubles is like a blank canvas. You can just literally use your imagination throughout all of it. And it, it game sense is just super important as well, just knowing, like, mm -hmm what angle uh, hitboxes will send your opponents yep. into your teammate. Even even simple things like uh, just like the start of the game or, or the 2v1 like are so, so crucial in doubles. Mm -hmm. And right now we're going to be seeing Stocktaker and Zenkai fighting Son and DZ who just won the previous set. So I believe this is losing semi, uh, semis. Yeah, it should be semis. So I, then, I believe that was quarters before. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know who's above them. I think probably the double Yoshi team is yep. sitting in losers finals Raptor currently. Raptor and Suarez, yep. And then in winners finals we've got PK Chris and Zero to None. And uh, yeah, Zenkai opting for the Mewtwo. I know he was playing Doc earlier in the doubles tournament, but Doc? No, more, no more messing around for this man. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, Mewtwo and doubles is definitely not something I've seen quite... I, I haven't seen at all, actually. So I'm really, really curious to see how this is going to play out. And you see, like, Stock Ticker right off the bat, he is the aggressor in the set. He's the one that's, like, letting Mewtwo set up, like, the the, char, uh, the Shadow Ball. And, uh, yeah. and just, like, basically acting like a quick little meat shield for a second. Which is, like, really, really good because that Shadow Ball can just, like, catch your stock, catch, uh, catch you off guard, and deal so much percent in a really, really short amount of time. On paper, we're going to be seeing Wolf acting as the main aggressor in this. I feel like Zenkai knows mm -hmm. Mewtwo's, uh, Mewtwo's shortcomings and that he's super duper big and super duper light. So yep. he's going to be sharking those platforms for those tilt punishes. He's going to be hanging on the edge for a stray hit here and there. And he's going to be netting those end. edge cards with that sword he has attached to his body. And I'm surprised that um, Z uh, DZ was still able to make it back from so deep into the blast zone after he got back here, but I think he held on to his jump. Regardless, a phenomenal recovery attempt coming from DZ. Uh, trying to get the F throw on Sone, but the up smash poking through his shield, I believe. Maybe Sone dropped it a little bit preemptively. Regardless, it'll still net him the stock, and that is what is important. It's, it's, it's Stock Taker plays very, it depends on the character he's playing, but he'll try to use Wolves' uh, moves with the best priority. Like, he'll be approaching with Nair pretty much almost all the time. Yeah. And either that or uh, Fair to really get the aggression. I'd like to see them go after Zenkai a bit more or yep. just use their good, uh, their, their quick options to really deal with Stock Taker. The way you deal with Wolf is is taking advantage of the fact that you can stuff him out. If, he, if you get one good jump read, you'll be able to keep him out. That's and that yeah. is, oh, mm-hmm. And I did notice a percent on, uh, oh. on DZ there. I thought that might have been the sock, but they're taking another <laughs> two for one right there, cleaning so, up both um, Zenkai and Stock Taker. So Zen Zenkai saw that Stock Taker was trapped in the roller, and he tried to come through for the save, but he ended up just eating mm -hmm. the, the Pablo Picasso right to his face. And uh, Mewtwo's F throw is definitely a very, very potent throw in doubles because that, like, it basically sets up this huge, huge line that your opponent cannot cross to, like, maybe intercept their teammate and just, like, help that them out. Wow. But the quick draw actually, I don't know if that was intended at all, but the quick draw actually saving uh, DZ right there. Mm -hmm. I want to see uh, DZ try to go for like maybe a nair or a back air over the ledge. Te you can get teleport recoveries pretty wow. reliably before they hit the ledge. Uh, Inkling doesn't have too much committal off stage. Mm -hmm. Like Inkling can kind of just slip and slide around. And I, de I definitely want to see the punishing uh, Mewtwo's recovery mm -hmm. a bit more. Yeah, because me, uh, the thing is with like all the teleport recoveries, it's, and it has such a, like a distinct audio cue before it and such a distinct visual cue that the timing is more or less going to be consistent unless they choose to mix it up on a platform. Oh my god! Right there. The read, yeah, great read wow. on the air dodge right there by Sone. Sone is known for doing a lot of that, that mm -hmm. stuff right there. 
it's like there is so little risk for so much reward involved with something like that, especially if you're sitting at 42% as Ike. Like, why not go for it? Like, what are they going exactly. to do? What's, what's, the, what's the risk? Because DZ was doing a great job of micromanaging uh, Stocktaker already that he had yeah. really nothing. Stocktaker was so prioritized on um, trying to take out DZ that he failed to notice that Sone had his uh, team ledge trap. And Ike's ledge trapping is super duper scary. His aerials cover so many options mm -hmm. at any given time. And the up throw Ooh. coming from DZ almost, wow. The Booyah, yeah. Mewtwo being so big, his window, his window. Oh my god, and the back throw to up smash. Perfectly positioned. Right Cleaning up, that's what I'm saying. These guys are storied mm -hmm. teammates. They know exactly what to do in any given yep. circumstance. Sone being the MVP right there, he really clutched out that F smash right there. It was looking pretty dire yep. for, the, uh, for the yellow team up until that point. That's the thing, in doubles, you kind of got to be a little more patient. It, it, I feel like there's an additional level of pressure or chaos applied in mm -hmm. doubles because, like, some situations you'll be, you'll be caught up in and be like, how do I land? How do I land? And you'll be a little too but eager and, and press some sort of defensive option. And that's uh, kind of what spelled Zenkai's demise right there. Just just great pickups yep. also by DZ as well. Like, DZ also sealing that, that stock at, like, I think 80 mm -hmm. on Zenkai earlier just with the, the booyah. That was lit. And right off the bat, like, you see, oh, my God, like, what DZ has been doing consistently is just, like, dealing so much damage, especially with, like, the splatter shot, because it does have the damage multiplier after all, which is just so, so dangerous in doubles, especially against a character like Mewtwo, who's not going to be living that long anyways. Um, like, Inkling multi-jab is definitely going to be a problem um, right now. So, and this is his opportunity to edge guard Zankai, but Stockseeker coming to his rescue, just making sure to push him off just a little bit, making sure he can't uh, perpetuate his advan uh, d advantage any longer. I, I like... I, I just want to mention how accurate DZ has been with his rollers this entire set. Like, he's he's been, like, at least, like, seven for eight on rollers yep. he's been throwing out just to get the bury or just to cause some sort of disruption on stage. That being said, though, Stock's going to be traded right there, one by Shadow Ball, mm -hmm. one by, I think, back here it was. It's just looking a lot, uh, a lot hairier. I still, I still love yellow team's positioning. The thing is, it's, 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 it can be difficult for certain team dynamics because Zenkai knows that he has to operate on the outskirts. It can make it a bit harder for him to, to help pick up Stock Taker, like yep. off of Stock Taker's, uh, off of his hits. Because Mewtwo definitely in doubles, like capitalizes so much on just like playing back, charging up just a little bit, and then wow, right and right there, like pre preparing yourself with like those edge guards because that down smash is brutal and it will kill you so so early. It's so fast too, and doesn't have much. And like and right there, like because he had that shadow ball on deck, he was ready to punish DZ and take out his stock. I like the stage pick a lot more on this one. It, it gives less real estate for both Sone and yep. uh, and DZ to kind of land on. And you can really press them. Like, that being said, though, DZ dropping a fair amount of stocks pretty early this game. Just like, I noticed he's been either cornering Stock Taker or Zenkai, and he's been throwing out a move before uh, Zenkai is committed to an offensive option, or, or, or Stock Taker for that matter. And he's been kind of eating a lot of damage for it. Wow. I'm not even sure what happened in that exchange, but regardless, Sone will be losing a, whole, a stock. A whole lot of hits. Stock taker and Zankai are now sitting in the first like serious advantage in the set. Both of them at two stocks to each, and DZ at 103%. Stock taker building it more with the dash attack into back air, and this is, looks like it's wow. It's going to be a massacre. Jesus Christ. And that just, jab doing so much damage. Mm -hmm. Mewtwo's jab getting buffed, it, it does a considerable amount uh, more of damage. Mm -hmm. it, it, it looks like... Game three, yeah. Yep. Sone is pretty good at making 2v1 comebacks, uh, but when you're down, like, three stocks, it's, it's, it's not going to look too pretty. Mm -hmm. So going into game three, I'm just trying to f figure out, like, what was happening in this set versus the last one. I feel like in this set, Zankai was doing a whole lot more cleanup yeah, on the sure. stocks. Yeah, absolutely. He, he, his, he was netting quite a bit of kills yep. as well just because he smushed himself in the corner so well. Mm -hmm. Had that shadow bar charged up to, to punish any potential whiff or scuffed approach yep um i think the additional real estate of fd also helps that as well it, it, mm -hmm. it provides for more linear gameplay i guess mm -hmm. uh because with the platforms on ps2 it can be a lot harder to get coverage and inkling and i definitely like platforms like a lot speaking and, of platforms and i feel like if stock to, um excuse me if stone and dz want to take this they really might need to just like sort of jump in on zenkai a little bit a little bit more and not let stock take be that meat meat shield that he kind of wants to be right now and i think that i think their intention is that very clearly because you notice we took it to smashville which doesn't have too much real mm -hmm. estate it allows for for dz and stone to just kind of go ham 
Yep. Uh, it's a really, really tiny stage. Both of these characters are going to capitalize off of the small platforms. Really, really easy tech chases and just so easy to assert stage control on this kind of stage. And then so easy just to like really, really get in on more defensive type uh, play styles. And right now, <laughs> getting the fully charged Shadow Ball on I like on it, DZ. but like, I feel like it was the wrong place to do that. Like He would have gotten a, few, a little bit more damage by capitalizing that, but when you're off stage sometimes, especially against a character like Mewtwo, where you yeah. can kind of just get your, your uh, attacks whiffed, and especially when he's throwing out Shadow Ball so safely, because Stock Taker's nowhere near him, right? Uh, mm -hmm. He tried going for the up air to try and get some more damage, because I really don't think that would have killed, and he kind of yep. ended up eating a big Shadow Ball for it. And now we're looking at a pretty even game. And now DZ uh, making a fantastic effort of getting back onto stage with the up throw onto a stock ticker. Um, and right now Sony has to find a way to get back. Of course, it's going to be landing right onto, um, I believe, stock ticker shield and reasserting stage control for himself. And the dash attack from yeah. Zakai was beautifully placed and timed. Just like able to really, really just sweep him out. The move is hella quick and it's, it's a great... Uh, assistance to your teammate to throw that move out. Mm -hmm. and it, it's also super duper powerful. It sends you super duper far. That was almost a team kill. Yep. That was very scary. And again, like I really love Zenkai's usage of the F throw there because it's just like this impenetrable space for Son, right? Because like Son wants to jump in on you with those neutralists. He wants to jump in on you, but he can't do it because it's like this big diagonal line that's just this biz, big moving hitbox that's just going to push you away. So I love the usage of the F throws here. Um, right now, Zenkai is trying to get something started with those falling aerials, but it'll only able to connect the confusion. These separate 1v1s have actually been paying a lot of dividends because I feel like Sohn and DZ work immaculately together. However, when they're divided a little bit, it can be yep. hard because uh, Ike struggles, struggles pretty immensely against Wolf. Mm -hmm. uh, Inkling doesn't particularly struggle against Mewtwo, but Zenkai's just so good at keeping you boxed in the corner that Ooh. he can't really get to Sohn to save him at all. Yep. And right now, Stockstick is making a great job coming back onto stage again. So and so not anticipating the aggressive option. And right now, he has to find a way to get back as soon as possible to help out Zenkai. Uh, rather, Zenkai has to f get back as soon as possible to help out Stockstaker. But Stockstaker oh. able to oh push no. his way through with the dash attack. That was and, so unfortunate. Yeah. But somehow, I don't know what happened to Stockstaker. Probably got up smash or, or something like that. Now it's looking very close right now. Oh, if he gets his down air, that would have been amazing. So yep. Sohn's down airs are super duper consistent, but I don't think I think Zenkai mixed up the timing with the, the teleport really nicely. Yep. You saw him like drift in a little bit. He's very, very confident in Mewtwo's recovery distance, like knowing, okay, I can afford to wait, but the back air cleaning up DZ stock. And right now, all they need to do is pile on the damage onto Sohn. But if Sohn can get the edge guard, which <gasps> Okay, great he, air dodge right there. I like that. Cause if he, oh, he's dead. Yep. Wow. He had, I don't know if he had no jump left or he didn't want to wait to do the up B. But uh, that being said, though, Zenkai doing a really good job as cleanup crew. Like, off stage, that, that back air mm -hmm. encompasses so much space. And net stock's pretty, pretty early. Yep. And uh, so right now 